fam it's been a while hasn't it well only two days but <laughs> you love me really uh well as you can see i'm no longer half colored i'm full-on auburn so and apologies for the fringe i am going to be getting it trimmed and thickened just uh at the moment it's at my eye level so i will be playing around with it but i hope well, I hope you like the new colour. I was like this for a while. Um, growing my hair out again. Um, excuse me for the ums and all that. Uh, well, it's been a busy few couple of days, hasn't it, my sweet Cassandra? We are going <laughs> to... You can see her. She's... Pikachu! Whoopsie! <laughs> <laughs> oh well you've seen her only briefly um apologies for that but she's not much for the camera she just loves playing around she is getting a new bed tomorrow um it's got a little dangly ball and well fuzzy ball so and it's a proper little cozy bed she doesn't like her fluffy bed but fluff likes it so we'll do that let me put my glasses on so i can read my notes go okay so hair dye and as i said on uh, yesterday i got my ring fit the leg straps just over there and i have to say it really requires strength and i will say it is a f brilliant form of exercise they have really it's made a great way to exercise um i think if guys if you remember that in uh, the original wheeze and all that we only had a flat board this brilliant just two controllers one for your leg one for this and it requires a lot of arm stretching a lot of walking and you know what i already starting to feel the strength coming back to my legs like you know I'm, I'm a little bit exhausted today i might not exercise just because i did so much walking yesterday uh i did enjoy doing the walking um as i mentioned on spider-man i went and got some drinks uh, of course mountain dew i have two of these it was two for two pounds and let's face it it's been a while since the full-size mountain dews have been that price uh the next would be Poka ice melon tea I'm oh, sorry, that's back to front, but it's good. Uh, I haven't tried it yet, but I have. I did try the lychee version, and that was delicious. And it is just literally just tea with melon, well, melon juice added. It's not like you know any artificial stuff, which you do find a lot when you come to like you know English teas. So uh, next is ramune. I'm already going through my uh what's it blackcurrant one not a fan of the blackcurrant i am fan of the peach this is the original lemon flavor which pretty much it's just lemonade but it's it's just a bit of fun like you know opening it and just the little marble inside uh that looks like the marble in this one may have swollen a bit that's why we were struggling to open it last night and finally i have just classic c2 green tea which is just normal tea, green tea. Uh, so it says here, C C2 is cool and clean, enjoying ref enjoy refreshment like no other. It's brewed from 100% natural tea, green tea leaves, camellia, senesis, and bottled the same day. So, fresh tea. I'm a fan of tea, if you didn't know. <laughs> So Cassandra, she's getting better with the dogs now. She she doesn't much mind Ivy, uh, and she doesn't much mind uh, uh, Mika or Bonnie. Uh, you've seen pictures of them on my Instagram, which you know they're just plain adorable. So they've been fantastic. Just it's fantastic that they have just started to work well together. Uh, I'm taking these glasses off now because I don't need to read my notes. Uh, as for parents, I saw them yesterday. They gave me some of my old recipe books. Uh, Rachel Allen Bakes. Um, 
that was one of my favourite cookery books actually. They've given me a new Mary Berry, they've got the wrong Mary Berry, but because <laughs> I got one of her newer white books that, um, you know, had the signature in, like, you know, because she was there for an autograph day and I missed it. Uh, well, I've met celebrities in my time and uh, just saying meeting celebrities is fantastic, but don't get your hopes up. They're, they're not they're not crazy like you know with fans uh talked about school if you guys didn't know i went to saint nicholas school for girls very prestigious school where i was from and i worked hard you know what i worked i did work hard in my own way but then i was dealing with my bisexuality at the same time because i think i knew was i was by about around 10 years old because even though I could I liked flirting with boys like you know like every normal you know, like you know 10 year old words like you know it's like you start getting interested in boys but you're not full on that um and then I had to deal with early puberty I think I was 11 once I had my first period and it was on Halloween which made it extra scary like I thought something like spooky happened but literally, um, I was 11 and I had my first period and I didn't even have an A cup. I literally, I was already a largish girl, but um, I went, uh, being 11, 12 and you're already a B cup, like, eek, is terrifying because everyone else is flat chested still. And it just, uh, then I just realised, you know what, I'm going to be a chunky girl, I'm going to have chunky that's that's my genetic my sister got the sort of slim figure i got the very curvy figure and you know what even though i'm doing ring fit and you know doing the exercises like i get the beats from here saying that i do my 250 sets a day uh well not like an hour so that i can do many steps uh it turns out i don't really want to be skinny i, I would like to be healthier like you know you know just having a slimish body like you know just a healthier body but in terms of you know let's say oh I'm trying to think of a famous actress who's super skinny but i can't but like you know model skinny like you know i would never be that skinny and let's face it most of them torture themselves to be size zero it's like there's, there's, there shouldn't be a size zero. I'm sorry, but that size zero should really be equals death to them. So it's like, no, I would not torture myself with all that. <sighs> what else? Uh, my school was good. Like, you know, I was a unicorn in, in terms of houses. Hence why I have a unicorn hoodie. Because <laughs> I'm still a house girl from all, after all these years. Uh, we had... We had normal lessons. Um, <clears throat> most of you, most schools finished around two, three p.m. Ours finished around four, five. <clears throat> Excuse me. Tight throat today. Well, anywho, it was nice talking to my parents. Had a bit of cake, just talking about the past. Uh, they didn't have my Pandoras. So they've lost them, which is quite adorable if you think about it. Um, I will be streaming tomorrow, uh, still Spider-Man, I finally, finally got Bubby to play it last night and he was just so frustrated, he can understand why I was frustrated at the beginning, but the thing is, I did better than him at the beginning in terms of the fight scenes, but he's better than me in terms of speeding with the, um, uh, webs. So he's better at that with me than me. So we sort of complement each other. He is very much swinging. I'm very much, I punch you in the face. <laughs> well, kick you in the face mainly. But uh, I've had a really good time. Uh, we'll do a like picture of the room. Um, well, the I've, I've got quite a bit of knitting to do in terms of little small amigurumis, which if you guys don't know, they're like felted little mini animals made of just knitting. 
I've done quite a few of them in the past. I did a bunny and a monkey. The my bunny looks almost like a like a pig though. I don't know how that happened, but it happened. Um, I'm ditching this morning's OU because. I just can't be asked with it right now. I want to get my, this done. Um, it's introduction week, so literally it's just stuff like how to study, what, what we're studying. It's well, Next week is going to be the more important week. Uh, I'll be, uh, I will start put, um, working on the actual search engine optimization of the YouTube channel so you can see better thumbnails, better descriptions, better tags and all that. So you'll be able to find me. It's it's so strange. It's just so strange that I know my life isn't super exciting, even though I am going through so much drama at the moment. But the thing is, this is a blog. This is just me giving you life updates, just more uh, things about Cassandra, how my fit, how I'm doing personally, uh, like you know, hair dye, <laughs> and then of course the ring fit, how I'm getting better with my health. This is not going to be like, oh, I'm traveling the world. No, I'll travel once a year. I don't know, we can't do, we couldn't do it this year, but we're doing it next year, which I think is brilliant. And I get to go with Jane, so then we can have a little girl's time and Tom can, you know, get my guy out and just <laughs> do what he wants. He doesn't have to be with me 24-7. And I think that works for us. I, I don't understand, I understand couples who were like, you know, when I was a teenager, I was one of those 24-7 girls. But then as I grew older, I thought, actually, he needs his space, I need my space. And we sort of work that out with between us and then we get to have like you know spider-man like you know i was a backseat gamer <laughs> and i know that's a few few of you groaning on that bit and it's like oh no she's one of those no yeah I'll, if i know the game i'll say wait no go left go right kick him there triangle x like you know it's like so i will be like if i know the game maybe but if I don't know the game, I'll be just like, oh, what's going on there? <laughs> and if I don't, I just read it up online. I don't like disturbing gamers. Because let's face it, disturbing a gamer in the middle of this game, <laughs> not a good idea. Anywho, I think that is me. I am going to do some chores now, get this room all tidy so I can, like, you know, tidy room, tidy mind sort of thing. And I hope to hear some comments from you guys soon. Please, please like and subscribe. And I will get to you as soon as possible. So thank you and goodbye.